Okay, this how-to video is going to talk about uh, how to use the design compare feature from inside AllCAD Capture. So this feature basically allows you to compare two uh, DSN files, file name .dsn, um, and get the differences and you can get a graphical difference and a list as well. So what you'd normally do is um, you don't have to have a design open but you can literally just go to tools and then compare designs and then we've got a browser here so I'm going to browse for the name of the name of design one so I've got one called design and we'll browse for the name of the, the other design so design three that gives me the two designs I can then start going down to the to the granular level of saying I want to compare it based on a schematic folder I can or I can just do all the same for pages I can pick a specific page or all and then some basics of what the design name is going to be and what browser it uses basically a browser to to uh, open the design compare it uses Google Chrome which is the recommended one. We'll then click on compare which brings up um, the differences and I've got the logical differences or all differences so what we'll do is we'll just click on the show details option here and this is then going to launch um, Google Chrome And I now see a graphical representation between the two designs and then a list between the two designs. So let's have a look at maybe what the component differences are. We can click on the little plus and you can see um, in this one R62, R63, D6 and Q10 don't exist in the original design but they do exist in, uh, exist in design 3. And if we double click on any of these effectively it will zoom and center to where it is on the page. Um, so we can have a look at that. So you can see we've added that there's been a new LED5 option here. Um, for us to go along so we can actually just zoom out so it looks like we've added a new LED 5 here and a new LED option here and these are options are this is kind of a graphical representation of that and then we can look at maybe the, the nets and let's look there's a new LED 5 net here and then the individual nets connecting those objects together so that gets to the IC and then obviously the items between the diode and the resistor quite a useful function